everyone welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome to a new in spring haul so i have a real mixture of things to show you guys in this haul it's kind of like one item from each place so it's a little bit random but i have lots of really nice new in bits that i wanted to share with you and i thought rather than do it in a vlog i'll just pop them all together and do a new in haul like a what's new in my wardrobe so i'm gonna start off with my favourites. I've got a nice little goodie bag from Monica Vinader and some beautiful new pieces that I kind of chose specifically for the change in season and the weather getting warmer. I thought these pieces would work really really well, some of them on holiday. Um, obviously I wear Monica Vinader day to day, it's all I've got on at the moment, but I thought it would be nice to have some like more special pieces that I can just bring out in the summer months so i'm going to start off with a big box this is a bangle now you guys know i wear my signature bangles i have the normal skinny one and then i have the one with the diamonds on as well i wear them so much but i picked up this one as well and this is called the wishbone bangle and i just loved the texture of it obviously you can see it's got kind of like a v at the front here but I loved the mottled texture and the irregular shape. I thought it was so beautiful. And this is one of those pieces that I thought would work specifically well in the warmer weather. I just pictured this kind of stuck a little bit further down my arm with like a gorgeous white dress on holiday. I thought it looked so beautiful. Works really, really nicely with my thin bracelet as well. This is the Marquise diamond one that I have literally been wearing non-stop. I put this on probably about a month ago and I haven't taken it off. I've showered in it. I've literally worn it 24 seven. And I mean, yeah, the quality is insane. Like with all Monica Vinader, but yeah, I thought this bangle would look so beautiful in the summer. Obviously it would be great for every day as well. I pictured this with maybe some other statement gold jewelry, some statement earrings, maybe on holiday. So I think I may save that for then, but I'm gonna leave it on now because it does look really cute. So that is the wishbone bangle. Before I forget, you guys can still use my 20% off discount code. It's amybeth20 and obviously gets you 20% off with which is such a good saving. Most discount codes will only ever get you 10% off, so 20% is a huge saving, so definitely worth checking out if you want to refresh your jewelry collection for the change in season. So next up, I picked up a ring, and I really do have the most beautiful collection of Monica Vinida rings now. I have so many gorgeous ones, and this one is gonna add to the collection so beautifully so this is called the reva diamond hoop ring and i already have a few items from the reva kind of collection it's got a really thin gold band and then obviously the kind of diamond hoop detail and the way it looks on your finger i just think is stunning so i already have this twisted reva ring on my index finger i thought that the hoop ring would work so nicely on my ring finger i love the two together i do tend to stack my monica vinida rings as i've done with these two signature ones on the other hand but i think this one it's just kind of like a statement piece on its own and i wouldn't want anything else to detract from it i think it would even look great with nothing else on my hand like that really really beautiful yeah but i love this other reaver ring so i'm gonna put that back on but look at this arm and hand candy so beautiful so yeah this is the reaver diamond hoop ring and it's so stunning it's 18 karat gold vermeil and it has the ethically sourced diamonds in it as well they are so dainty and beautiful. If I come in a bit closer, I should be able to see them a bit better. But yeah, such an elegant ring and I absolutely love it. I've had my eye on it for a while. It's just different to all the other pieces that I have and it slots in my collection beautifully. If you watched, I think it was my most recent vlog or maybe the one bef before, I organised all of my Monica Vinader pieces into the new jewellery box that I got. Oh my goodness, it's so nice having them all in one place. They look gorgeous in the little box. So I'm looking forward to adding these ones in. The final item that I got from Monica Villager is actually a little pair of earrings. I don't have too many earrings from there and I wanted another pair of something simple that I can wear every day. 
If I zoom in on my ear now, so in my third hole I have the Marquise studs which match the diamond on my bracelet here. So a really, really beautiful stud. And then in my second hole, I think these are called the Siren Huggies. Really beautiful, just like a simple, small gold hoop. And then I picked up, these are the Siren Muse Diamond Essential Mini Huggy Earrings. They're really similar to what I have in my second hole, but obviously they have the little diamond charm on them. So just something a little bit extra. But how pretty does that little ear party look so gorgeous and a really nice piece for every day something a little bit special and a little bit more detailed than just the plain huggy that we have here um, but i love the way these two t look together and you could even go with like a third huggy as well on the third hole but I quite like the difference in adding a stud in these little diamond charms as well are detachable so you could take them off if you did just want to have like a plain huggy but I think they look that much more special with the charm on but you've kind of got like a two-in-one with that situation but if you wanted something a bit more simple that is all the gorgeous pieces that I got from Monica Vida this month obsessed with them all as usual you guys know how much I love Monica Vida it's a brand that I have worn for years and years and years so it's very very exciting that i get to work with them and i adore these pieces as always i will leave everything linked in the description box for you in case you guys want to shop i also have my own little edit page as well so you can look up all the jewelry bits that i own from monica vinida and have a little browse through and just a reminder my code is amybeth20 and as always that will get you 20 percent off your monica vinida order all of that will be in the description box but let's now move on to the clothing haul all the rest of the bits here that i have are clothing items the first one i'm going to show you is a jacket that i got from zara and i've wanted something like this for a long time but i could not find the perfect one I have been buying bomber jackets for a while now. I have a big old collection. Some of them I did send back because nobody really needs like six bomber jackets, but I finally found the perfect one and this is definitely my favorite. So this is an all black bomber. They call it a maxi bomber on the website. I'm not really sure why because it's kind of cropped, but I just love the shape of this. It's so structured. It's got like these shoulder pads. So it gives a really nice chic shape. Um, I love that the buttons are black so it all kind of blends in. This looks really nice done up as well with a pair of jeans and converse. Also looks great with midi skirts and dress down a bit more casually. Would look fab over a lounge set as well. It's just a really versatile piece. I do think that out of all the bomber jackets I've bought recently from Zara, this one is my favourite in terms of fit. I think it was probably the most expensive as well. It was £80 or £90. So I do think that's quite a lot for what this is but... I wanted it so much and I love the fit of it and I've worn it so much already that it is kind of worth it. I got it in a size small and I think it fits really, really nicely. I think an extra small would have perhaps looked a bit strange and a medium would have been too boxy. So very happy with this. Um, I am going to insert try on clips if I can of these pieces because I'm pretty sure most of them I've already used to film like reels and stuff. So I should have some like try on clips that I should be able to insert for you guys so you can see them on. If I don't have a clip, then just head over to my Instagram because I'm pretty sure that all of this will be worn over there. Next up, I have a denim skirt that you have probably already seen on my YouTube channel, but I don't think I've included it in a haul video as of yet. So I thought I would pop it in this one. This is my new denim midi skirt. It's from Align and I absolutely adore it. Denim midi skirts and midi skirts in general are so on trend at the moment and I am so in love with this one. I've worn it loads already. It's such a nice shape, really nice length. It's got a split at the front, but it's kind of a really flattering split. Um, I'm not a huge fan of having like my legs out, so I was a bit concerned about that, but I think it looks really, really nice. I love how it's kind of like a charcoal denim as well, so it's not jet black. It's got a little bit of texture to it. And yeah, it's just a generally a really, really nice fit. I got it in a size eight. Um, and this is the first piece that I've actually got from a line and they're such a great brand really really amazing quality such beautiful pieces so it's definitely a brand that I am sure you will see again on my channel next up I actually have some active wear 
that I got from a recent collaboration that I have been doing with Gymshark over on Instagram. It's just the noise of me doing up the zipper. So this is the top and I could not show you guys this because I have been living in this. I've been reaching for this set constantly because it's so flattering and I'm just obsessed with the colour. It's like this beautiful top colour. So this is the top. It's like a full zip kind of running top with a nice little collar. But I've been wearing this kind of half open or fully open with a sports bra underneath. Um, I got it in a size small. Fits really nicely. It's super lightweight, really comfy. The colour is the main thing that I love about this. Um, it's just such a gorgeous colour, really flattering on. Um, but yeah, I've just been wearing this so much, especially on my dog walks and stuff. And then these are the matching leggings, obviously it's same colour. These are a really nice fit. The thing I love about these the most is they don't fall down when you're working out. Um, admittedly, I haven't, you know, around 5k in them, but I wear them for Pilates a lot and they don't fall down i'm not constantly like reaching to pull them up which i found a lot of leggings of this shape and this kind of thin material do but yeah i really love these and i've been wearing this set constantly i got the leggings in a size small as well this is kind of random but i thought i would include this in this video because it's such a cool t-shirt so this arrived recently from anita bing and i just thought it was so cute it's a really nice good quality t-shirt really nice like thickness round neck but i thought the pattern on it was just adorable bring it a bit closer you can see it better i don't really have anything like this in my wardrobe i have a lot of like plain white basics but i thought this would be so cute to just wear with like black leggings and trainers for running errands or around the house um it's just a really nice good quality oversized t-shirt and i got it in a size it was a medium yes i got it in a size medium so it is a little bit oversized but i just thought that was quite cute and i thought i would include it in this video keeping with the loungewear theme i have a set here that again i have been wearing non-stock so these are tried and tested and i love them so it's a jogger set a tracksuit from another version as you can see we've got the little logo on the side there and these are the bottoms they are obviously a pair of kind of straight leg tapered joggers really nice elasticated waist they've got pockets as well and elasticated around the ankles they are so soft on the inside really really comfortable um, i got these in a size small and they fit really really nicely you do not need to size up i did think should i have got a medium so they're like nice and oversized definitely not they're already an oversized fit and then to go with i have the hoodie which is obviously the same gray and has the same kind of another version motif on the side but this is such a comfortable set like i said i've been wearing it non-stop around the house and i thought this would be so good for traveling for the airport you can keep nice and comfortable nice and warm in it just pop like a vest top on underneath but yeah it's such a nice good quality tracksuit it fits really really well and I love the colour of grey. I think it's such a nice, perfect kind of mull grey colour. And finally, I have two sets to show you. And these are both very, very summery. Both pieces that I think I'll be keeping for my holiday. So the first one is from H&M. And as soon as I saw this on the website, I literally checked out immediately. So this is the top. And it's such a cute little bralette. It's like a lace up on the front. And it's got this embroidery on glaze on the front. I think because it's contrasted on the black, it makes it stand out even more. It's got these obviously spaghetti straps. And then the back is elasticated. So it's actually really, really comfortable and easy to get on. I thought this was so cute. And if I don't wear it with the matching skirt, I could definitely wear this with like cream wide leg trousers, which I think would look so cute. But this is the matching skirt. It's a little mini skirt with this wrap detail. Um, it's both the top and the skirt are in this kind of like linen blend material. And the embroidery on glaze goes all the way around the back, but really, really cute little set. I thought this would look so nice on a holiday, either with some flat black sandals or maybe with a heeled sandal and a linen shirt over the top. Um, I got both of these in a size eight. Oh no, I got the skirt in a six and I got the top in an extra small and they fit really really nicely it's such a gorgeous gorgeous set and i think they look a lot more expensive than they were and then finally i have another set this is from pretty lavish and i love this i'm so excited to wear it properly because i haven't obviously yet because the weather is rubbish but this is the top and it's like a little knitted bandeau top 
with a curved kind of neckline which i think is really cute just like a nice little basic this would be so handy to wear underneath blazers and stuff um and i adore the color and then the skirt that goes with it is like a long ribbed almost medaxi skirt it's really really long elasticated waist so it's really comfortable i got both the top and the skirt in a size extra small and they fit really nicely i just love this set i think it's really gorgeous nice and simple classic it's going to look great with sandals and a blazer over the top for this country which is how i envisage wearing it for um a birthday dinner that i have coming up i think it's going to look great with like tan accessories obviously I have my tan orans tan um Loewe basket bag and jacquemus bag are both tan as well but i just think this set is so gorgeous perfect for summer really really simple and i hope they bring it out in more colors i would love it in black or maybe like a taupe color as well so that was everything from my new in haul i really hope you guys enjoyed seeing what's new in my wardrobe let me know what you think in the comments down below don't forget you can use my monica vinader code amybeth20 as always everything that i have shown you today will be linked in the description box if you did enjoy this video it would be amazing if you could give it a like if you are new to my channel I would love it if you subscribed and I will see you all very soon with another video. Bye.